Welcome. I'd like to spend a few minutes and show you the lock date feature in T Value Online. In T Value Online, uh, if you're on a date, let's say the date is on the 30th and you want your payments to be on the 30th going forward. Generally, when you're on the 30th, the next payment will be on the 31st and that'll create all your payments on the 31st. But we have the new lock date feature. Let me show you how that works. You'll see here that we have options of the 28th, 29th, or 30th. These first two would be for February. Uh, the, this uh, last one will be for uh, all months ending in the 30th. And let's go to T Value Online and show you how it works. So we say have a line uh, alone on uh, 930, which would be the 30th. If we go to the payment line, Payments are going to be on the end of the month, the 31st, which is normal for most programs. In T-Value Online, I can now lock the dates on the 30th. I can go here, right click, and it's going to bring up my locks. I can hit end of uh, end by the 30th, hit save. Now when I go to line two, you'll see I have the lock uh, 30th, and my payments are now on the 30th, and we'll go ahead and just put View for unknown, we'll put 12 just to see how it looks. And go to the amortization schedule. And we'll see now that our payments other than February will all be on the 30th. So a nice little feature. Uh, if your agreement says payments are on the 30th, you got to make them on the 30th. And um, if you ever need any help, feel free to give us a call. 800-426-4741. Or you can email us at info at timevalue.com. Thanks for listening.